I'm Brandon Bomb 7 with more defense tactics. Uh, what I wanted to discuss tonight is that with defense tactics, there is a instinctual reaction that we all have, and there is a practical application of that instinctual reaction. Say, if someone grabs our wrist, we usually want to grab onto our own wrist or the opponent's wrist. Now, usually if someone grabs onto our wrist, uh, we grab on. That's the instinctual reaction. And the practical application to it is to step in, pull, lean back, and kick someone in the groin, and then yank, and you have, you're free. Uh, if someone uh, tries to choke us front, frontal, the practical application to that, uh, or just tug on our shoulders, uh, the practical application to that is um, to grab at the uh, uh, at our neck or the opponent's hands. Um, usually, the opponent's hands is the best instinctual reaction um, because, um, and the practical application to that is to you know, sort of yank at the opponent's hands, and if you're close enough, you knee at the opponent's groin, or if you're far away, if the opponent has longer reach, longer arms, you tug, tug, and at the same time, kick at the opponent's groin, or the opponent's legs, or knee joints, whatever, which one works. You know, you, you, you can do the shins, you know, whichever will get you out of it. Um, if the opponent um, gets you in a bear hug, you know, your first instinct is to grab the um, opponent. Uh, your first instinct is to grab the opponent's hands that are grabbing you, which is very good. And you usually tuck, want to tuck the, your thumbs on the opponent's wrist joints. Um, uh, that's because, you know, they go, usually go for a wrist lock in the practical application. Um, that's, uh, and, you know, that's good. And the practical application is you do a Tai Sabaki escape, which we discussed in previous videos, um, uh, which is um, if somebody has you in a bear hug, you grab, um, uh, you can sort of you know, kind of do a knuckle buster um, and sort of poke at the uh, poke and prop and knuckle bust at the um, at, at the fit at the opponent's uh, fists till um, he you know he sort of loses his grip and he can let go. Or you do the t which is easier do the Thai Sabaki escape, pull the arm, pull his arms up and do a reverse Thai Sabaki. Uh, elbow him in the face and sweep at the same time while doing um, uh, an elbow clothesline. Now, that's one of the harder practical applications, but you get the gist of it. Um, uh, another um, type of um, thing, uh, you know is more common practical applications and instinctual reactions is from a punch. Usually what people, you know, not not usually, you know, because people, you know, don't really have the instinctual reaction like other animals do, um, and they don't see it coming, is, you know, usually from sucker punches or punches. Um, usually if they see it coming, what people do is they'll, you know, they'll be frightened or surprised. You know, put their hands up like this, you know, kind of like like this. That's good. That's the that's the guard. You know, that's a good guard. Uh, the practical application to it is to tighten up your fists, block, and then grab or wrap around the attacking the attacking weapon or or fist or whatever and then come in at an angle all at the same time and then counter with a good punch to the the nerve centers or 
like the throat, poke in the eye, gouge the eye. Um, if they're taller or something, you want to, you know, swoop down and punch at the groin or something. You know, hit them in the solar plexus. Um, bunch of things. Um, or you can palm and uh, put them, you know, in a, you know, sort of like a palm clothesline and then push with the palm and then come in and sweep them and take them to the ground. That's the best way to do it, is just take them to the ground. And if it's a slow thing, um, usually if there's more than one attacker, um, uh, then, you know, you want to, you know, if, if you're, you know, cornered, you want to, and the person attacks, you angle into that person, attack him, and if the, if the other person's trying to come around you, that, you know, one of his buddies is coming around you, then you kick low at him, you know, to try and push him off you. You know, that's a good technique to use. Um, uh, another practical application to use is with um, hair grabs. Um, you know, the, of course, the instinctual reaction is to grab your head or the opponent's hand. Usually, the best way is the instinctual reaction to grab your hand. Now, and then the practical application is to lower yourself, push in, and then, or, you know, lower yourself, go out, and then, and then kick at the, at the, at the lower center. Um, that's pretty much it for tonight. Um, Brandon Baum 007, I hope this has helped. Comments, concerns, subscribe if you want. Goodbye.